A Jacksonville mother is charged with child neglect after police say trash, roaches, and urine were found throughout the home. Well, police arrested 35-year-old Shauna Baker at her apartment in the College Gardens neighborhood. According to the arrest report, DCF removed all seven of the children living at the home. Baker is now out on bond. News for Jack's reporter Corley Peel spoke with her at her home this evening. Now she joins us live with what Baker had to say. Corley? Shauna Baker couldn't give me a straight answer when I asked her how her home ended up in those conditions that were found unsafe for her children. But she did tell me she wants to make things right. And according to police, DCF has been going to her home on a weekly basis. Seven children removed from this apartment last week after police say their mother, Shauna Baker, neglected them by letting them live in unsafe conditions. Baker is out on bond. I went to her home on Tuesday, and when she answered the door, she said she was in the middle of cleaning up her apartment. It's, it's messed up, but I'm okay. I'm making day by day. I'm living. Why is it messed up? <laughs> I really can't come like that. According to the arrest report, when a DCF investigator did a weekly check on the apartment last Thursday, they found the floors were dirty, sticky, and covered in urine. Dead roaches were also noticed, along with dirty mattresses on the floor without linen. Police say multiple walls had exposed beams showing sheetrock was missing, and an unprotected window where a child could easily crawl out of on the third floor. Do you know how the conditions got the way that they did? No, ma'am, I'm not for sure right now. Baker says she plans to clean up her home so she can get her children back. Where do you go from here? Get myself together. That's what I'm working on. That's what I'm doing. She also has a message for other single mothers. All I can tell you young girls, have kids, take care of them. It ain't easy to help. It's not. It's hard. It's real hard. I asked Baker where her children were taken, and she says they are in a safe place, and she's hoping that she'll be able to reunite with them soon. Reporting live from JSO, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.